Britney Spears gets licked by Mystery Man, goes topless in new videos shared days after announcing divorce. Sam Ascari filed for divorce from Britney Spears in August 2023, 14 months after the couple were married. Britney Spears seems to be relishing her single girl era, days after announcing she and ex Sam Ascari had split after six years together and 14 months of marriage. The I Am A Slave For You singer, who frequently updates her followers via social media, shared two suggestive videos Sunday evening, the first capturing Spears rolling around topless in her bedsheets as she stared seductively at the camera. Annie Lennox's version of I Put a Spell on You plays in the background. The second video shows Spears, 41, with an unidentified male who crouches down and licks up her leg. Spears explained that she had invited her fab boys over after an incident with the paparazzi. When you go to meet up with a so-called friend and drive an hour for chicken, she captioned that video. Then you have to wait in the car and need to use the bathroom. I knew paps were tipped off because the car I was in was never used before so how I was. I followed. Malibu Canyon Road is the most horrible road ever to drive on. So what does a bee like me do? I put my green dress on and show up at my friends. I invited my fave boys over and P-L-O-Y-E-D-A-L-L-N-I-G-H-T. Spears' ex Asari actually referenced the paparazzi in his own post to social media a day earlier, joking about his circumstances and asking his followers to choose his disguise for an eventual run. In with the paparazzi. Help me choose, he sees, Azari wrote, above three filtered photos, which showed the actor with varied hairstyles, facial hair, and at accessories. He included an answer box for users to reply. Ascari was the first to speak on the divorce, sharing a statement to Instagram last week. After six years of love and commitment to each other, my wife and I have decided to end our journey together. We will hold on to the love and respect we have for each other. And I wish her the best always. S happens, he wrote choosing not to elaborate. Asking for privacy seems ridiculous, so I will just ask for everyone, including media, to be kind and thoughtful. According to court documents obtained by Fox News Digital, Oscari cited irreconcilable differences when he filed for divorce on August 16, although the separation date was listed as July 28. Special Ops Lioness actor asked for spousal support as well as attorney's fees to be paid. After negative rumors circulated suggesting a more contentious split, his rep told Fox News Digital, there are many claims that Sam is challenging the prenup and threatening to exploit his ex-wife. With videos. However, all these claims are false as no negative intention has ever been directed towards her and never will be. Sam has always, always support her. On Friday, Spears chose a familiar way to break her silence by sharing a video of her dancing to Instagram. She captioned the post. As everyone knows, Hezam and I are no longer together six years is a long time to be with someone, so I'm a little shocked but I'm not here to explain why because it's honestly nobody's business, she exclaimed. I couldn't take the pain anymore, honestly. In some sort of telepathic way, I have been receiving so many messages that melt my heart from friends, and I thank you. I've been playing it strong for way too long and my Instagram may seem perfect, but it's far from reality. And I think we all know that, she wrote, acknowledging her fans. I would love to show my emotions and tears on how I really feel, but some reason I've always had to hide my weaknesses. 
If I wasn't my dad's strong soldier, I would be sent away to places to get fixed by doctors. But that's when I needed family the most. You're supposed to be loved unconditionally, not under conditions. So I will be as strong as I can and do my best. And I'm actually doing pretty d good. Anyways, have a good day and don't forget to smile, she concluded. The couple originally met on the set of Spears Slumber Party video in 2016 and married at her home in Thousand Oaks last summer.